Who is it? Kobezin. What's wrong? I'm going to at dawn like this? You'll get hungry. I think I'm going to die hungry than killed. Ugh. Ah, Sasuke, this is not a joke, so listen seriously. I have something to say to you. Kobezin? Oh, okay, we're all right. Tell me. It will take a little time. Follow me for a minute. Kalashikawa, isn't this the arsenal? Why this place? Satsuki, is your body okay? You haven't eaten anything for a few days now. Is it painful? Yeah, I'm hungry enough to die, but except for that, I'm fine. But what's this all of a sudden? It's giving me goosebumps. Actually, I have a favor to ask you. Well, what do you want to ask? Kill me. What are you saying? Did you commit a sin for being a perv? I get it. It's delightful that Kobazin is lusting for his girls, but it's not enough to kill you. I said I wasn't playing around. Yeah, so sorry. No, it was my bad. Sorry, I shouted out of nowhere. Oh, damn it. How do I explain this? Kalashikawa, are you about to die? I've been thinking all this time. When this division was born, it was our fault, right? Even if we had a little more food left, it wouldn't have been so serious. I can't deny it. Besides, until now, Kinjo was guarding the arsenal so no murder occurred. But eventually, Kinjo went crazy. No one is guarding the arsenal right now. If we don't make a decision now, someone will definitely commit a murder. So that's what Kabashikawa wants to say. Okay. You mean that the two of us who are the most guilty will take responsibility? Honestly, I didn't want to involve you. It was me who first suggested to eat the food. I wanted to end up by dying if I could. But I remembered Monokuma's words. A murder case must happen in order to escape. The ballroom and suicide is not accepted. In the end, you can't solve it alone, so you need someone else's help. But the person who helps you will also be bound to be executed for being the culprit. So I'll be at risk of death too. Yeah, I have no other person to suggest, only Teruya or you who committed the same crime. But you know, me and him are in bad ways right now. Of course I have no intention of recommending this, but the moment you accept this, you will die, Satsuki. Okay, I'll cooperate. What? I'm saying I'll do what Kobezin wants. So suddenly like this? Will you be okay with it? That you're going to die? Well, even if we're in the ballroom, we're going to die anyways. That's not what I... Rather than staying still like this and watching my friends become murderers, or starving them to death, I prefer to save everyone and die with Kobezin. Satsuki. Damn it, I'm really sorry because of me. You really are a good girl. However, there's one condition. What? What condition? I don't want to kill Kobezin, so Kobezin kill me. Uh, what, what are you talking about? It's the same no matter what way we die, but why do you want to be the, the one to die by my hand? If I become the culprit, I'll be executed by Monokuma then. I hate that. I'd rather be killed by Kobezin. You're gonna grab a gun in the arsenal here anyway and kill me, but do you think it hurts a lot when you're shot? not a pain or a problem. I don't like being killed by a thing like Monokuma. You don't want to? No, there's no way I can kill you. The same goes for me. How can I kill Gobezin? These two are so dumb. <sighs> There'll be no end to this. Instead of fighting, why don't we sit down with this nonsense? That's because Kobezin first looks at me and suggests the impossible thing to kill him. If you can't, why did you accept then? Then don't do it! That's no good. I've already decided. Then kill me already. Ah, uh, again, I can't do that. I really value Kobezin, so killing my friend is... I I'm not happy that I'm your favorite, okay? 
Wow, Kobezin's face is blushing. Ah, oh, idiot. I'm talking about an important thing here, and we're going back and forth. I'm not messing around. Oh, my stomach hurts because I haven't eaten anything. Uh, are you okay? You know, we don't have much time either. It's a fact that I might die tomorrow. In the meantime, the others may be in pain or planning a murder. Everyone's in trouble. Satsuki, what if we do it like this? You, have you ever seen a Western movie? A uh, Western movie? Haven't seen it, but I know what it is. They walk back and forth in the courtyard and turn around and shoot at the same time after some time passes. Yes, let's decide with that. In the worst case of all this, we could kill each other, but it's still not suicide, so the others will be able to live. It's uncomfortable that I have to shoot Kobezin, but... Okay, that would be fair. Let's deal with that. All right. If it's decided, let's pick. Let's move. Pick one pistol. Kobezin? Kobezin? Are you still not done? Let's take it as long to pick a gun. Oh, wait a minute, almost done. <sighs> okay, are you ready, Satsuki? I'm not a girl that goes back on her word. Besides, it seems to be more fun to decide this way. Fun, you say? <sighs> I already said it again and again, but seriously? I mean, we played a lot of games so far, right? Basketball, running, poker, darts. As a result of doing my best, without looking at all our fights at all, the total was equal. Was it like that? I remember the results of all of our previous matches, so probably so far. Kabeza and I had 14 matches, 6 wins, 6 losses, and 2 draws in perfect balance. You really have good memory on useless places. <laughs> Suddenly I thought that this was the last game, so it made me feel strange. I can't believe that I'm risking my life at all. If you want to give up now, you can tell me. I really don't want to force you. No, because I'm serious too. Like Kobashikawa said, I'll stop playing around. Are you ready? Yeah. From here, go back and take three steps. We'll shoot at the same time after that. Okay. Satsuki! Hirohiko! Uh, Kobashikawa? Kobashikawa! Haruhiko? Why, why, why did you do this? Ooh. Good, Sasuke. The last game was my victory. That's not what I mean. Why did Kobashikawa's hand explode? Sorry. I saw it. This is... This is unbelievable. Let's do it again. I was worried about what would happen if I died immediately in case I was hit in a bad spot. Fortunately, it looks like I'm still alive. Ugh. I'll tell you what I can. Sorry, Satsuki, I lied. Because you killed me and wanting to save everyone? That's not the truth. What? Who I really wanted to save is you, Satsuki. Me? Ugh. <coughs> it was useless information, so I didn't tell the others because it would just confuse them, but I was searching for a few days and I found a badge with the head of Monokuma on it. Because I found it, Monokuma appeared and said he would give a, pri a prize as a prize and congratulated me on finding the treasures. That's the treasure Monokuma said. It was really here. There it showed me in a photo of me and you kissing, doing a selfie. Kobashi Kawa, you're gonna tie like this. What kind of a joke? It's real. It shows. I remember her photo with you as my lover. You shouldn't forget. And then it vanished. Kobashi, Kawa, and Satsat. We've never done such a thing. 
looks the same for me too. There are no memories of pictures of me and you. Let alone kissing. We met here for the first time a month ago. <coughs> Why? It doesn't feel odd. Even if that photo was a manipulation, I felt unknown emotions. And I thought that I didn't want to let you die. I... I have no idea what you're saying, Kobachi-Kawa. Stop it. That's too cheesy. Put up with it. I'm already gonna die anyways. I wanted to say this much. That maybe I liked you after some point. Even if I die like this, there are guys like Kinjo, Mekaru, Maida, so they'll find out about this in a minute. So you better go back to your room. Act usual, act as usual, pretend you don't know anything. Leave the rest to me. What are you saying, Akobachikawa? Stop it! Stop talking! No matter how much they think, they won't know that I, the victim, did all these tricks. Part of it was to pretend to shoot you on purpose and give away my right hand. This, it's a pretty old gun. It can explode while pulling the trigger, even if you put normal bullets in the magazine. <coughs> Kobashikawa, you can't die! No, I'm going to die. And Satsuki, you can live. Leave it to me. I can't make someone as cheerful and happy as you die like this. Amazing! I'm sorry for doing this in such a crappy way. And when the trial is over, tell the other guys that you're sorry too. I'm sorry that I fought with Turiya. I'm sorry for sacrificing Kinjo and the others. I'm sorry that my feelings don't want Satsuki to sacrifice herself. Ow, 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 damn it, this hurts really badly. <laughs> Crazy, don't. Don't move, don't die. Of course, I'm doing this in order to die. Once you leave, I have to get the job done. You have to go now, before someone sees this. I hate this, this is wrong. I want to save you. Please go. <clears throat> because this is my last wish, please listen. I want you to live. But... Leave! Yeah, just do that. Thank you, Satsuki, whether it was real or fake. I still loved you. Uh... And then I went back to my room. As Kobashikawa said, I stayed still until morning. Uh, okay, so I can explain now. Um, when I played this the first time, I this part made me ball. Like I was like legitimately sobbing while doing this, and I'm sure I'm sure a lot of people wanted to see me react to Satsuki being the culprit and this whole story because she's my favorite character, and I'm really upset that the audio didn't pick up because I kind of would like to go back and see that too because I was literally sobbing. It was actually really embarrassing. Like I could not stop myself and I was doing like the um, climactic reasoning and I'm like, Satsuki, <laughs> like the whole time. Oh, but I really, it really, the sad music that's playing right now, that's what like triggered it last time. Um, I don't think I'm going to cry again this time because I know what's happening. But if I do, <laughs> I do. I'm an emotional person. I don't remember if I read this. And then I went back to my room, as Kobashikawa said. I stayed still until morning. I didn't know what trick Kobashikawa was going to do at that time. I wasn't sure until I heard your story in the trial. This is all I know. Like Yuki said, Kobezing was by me while intentionally trying to save me. In order to confuse you while doing so. In other words, he did everything in order to save me. What is this? <laughs> and I was like, kind of why are you crying? <laughs> Girl, why are you crying? That's my job. Th this is this is too much. I feel like she says that a lot. She always says everything is too much. This is just too much. Okay. What isn't too much for you, Kai? And Ariko was apologizing to me. And I tried to kill him. I... Ugh. I see now. 
If he saw the letter sent by Turiya, he wouldn't go to the arsenal in reverse. Nevertheless, the reason Kabashikawa went to the arsenal was because Haruhiko didn't even notice Turiya's letter from the very beginning. It was only to sacrifice himself and to save only Satsuki. Hold on! Then why? Why did he do it in the same way as Turiya Oturi? The gun exploded in his hand the same way. Unless he did some kind of trick and did it in advance. That's what I thought too. But when Haruhiko chose a gun, he was doing something in the corner for a long time. He was the kind of guy who was telling me that guns weren't fun or usual, so... I wonder if he had some kind of knowledge about them. This stupid idiot. He really gave up his life for others. And you... You just gave the opportunity that he arranged to let you survive. What were you thinking? I don't understand this at all. I know that Kabashikawa liked me. And he didn't want to do this. After all this, I've been struggling a lot since then. Until the class trial was held. I don't think that's the way. It's so unreasonable for all of you to die for just one person, right? I feel sorry for betraying Kabashikawa, but I'll be happier if you guys live. How can that be? What related familiar actions are law that puts one's life most importantly? You, for people you've just met. Well, I'm not as smart as Mekuru, so I don't think I can give a very cool reason for it. I just told myself that I was the culprit. Because it makes me convince myself that I did this. But, but then why? Why didn't you say everything from the very beginning and hide the truth even more suspiciously? Because you didn't even say the backstory. You just said that you were the killer. Say it's a rat confusing, confusing reasoning. That was because of Kobashikawa. He decided to take a chance between all of you in order to save me. Because of this... Especially if Kinja finds out, he would have seen from Kabashikawa's view, who had already died, that I would have insulted him. I didn't want to do anything that would put more disgrace on Kabashikawa anymore, because he already died to try to save my life. That's why I told you at the end. Still, I don't think badly of Kabashikawa. He wouldn't have thought of this, and if it wasn't for Kabashikawa, we would have all died. Such a thing. It's not possible. Satsuki chan. Are you really satisfied with that? Even if we live, you will die. No, I'm fine dying. Why are you all so worried? I'm very fine with my choice. No matter what happens, don't forget to smile. It's one of the teachings of my own brother. And it's my belief too. But after Haruhiko died, you cried, right? Well, that's off topic. Please just think Satsuki wasn't Satsuki for a minute. Satsuki. Yuki. Thanks to Yuki, I was able to do everything. Rather, I feel relieved. Oh, yeah. I was impressed to see Maida come up with the whole truth. About Kabashikawa. Yuki's a real teacher in my heart. Well then, Yuki, I think we can finish the trial soon. Give me that thing that you always do at the end. That? Yeah, that! Climax reasoning, let's go! Tears are ready. At this point, yeah, um, I was like full on bawling. Because I remember I, it said tears are ready, and I'm like, tears are ready, tears are already falling! Like, I, I could not stop crying last time. Um, I did get a little misty at this time. Didn't actually cry though, so I guess that's good. <sighs> yeah, and it was like so hard to read through this because I was I was just crying, you know.
これが事件の線母だよ。はあ。はあ、なぜか、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、私たちは、
Indeed Hard did the same thing that Tori did earlier. It was to load it with non-standard bullets. How Haruhiko did the same thing as Toria, I'm not exactly sure whether it was a coincidence or not. Maybe it was because Haruhiko, who had a lot of interest in firearms from the beginning, so I think he accidentally came up with the method by pure chance. Either way, there's only one reason Haruhiko did this. He didn't want to shoot the culprit. The two of them, ready to go, stand a few steps away and pointed their guns at each other after turning around. But even though the culprit sincerely tried to shoot Haruhiko, he was going to lose to them from the very beginning. And so, as Haruhiko intended, his hand was destroyed and he was shot by the culprit at the same time. The culprit, who couldn't understand the situation, ran to Haruhiko. Then Haru told them the truth. It wasn't us that Haru really wanted to save, it was the culprit themselves. Although Haruhiko was dying, he was hoping that the culprit would survive, and he said he would do the rest to save them since he still was breathing to do one last act. The culprit was unconvinced, but soon they decided to accept Haruhiko's last request, and left Haru to do the job once they got out. Of the arsenal, of course the, tra the trail of this was also being monitored by Kurokawa. After confirming that the culprit was safely gone, Haruhiko began the final cleanup while keeping his short life as much as he could. First, Haruhiko placed, picked up the flash and smoke grenades from the arsenal. And likewise, put a wooden plank inside the arsenal door between the handles and then put the flash and smoke grenades on top of it. This could only be done by the people inside, and thanks to that, there was a lot of difficulty when we tried to reason it out. The plank served to make the door to be forced open while being crushed, causing the grenades on top to naturally fall on the floor and activate. Subsequently, Haruhiko started messing around in the arsenal to make it look like the culprit did it, although it didn't connect to anything. And as a result of the repeating a series of processes and blocking the door and cluttering the interior, Haruhiko's bloodstains were all over the place. Inside the arsenal, it created an unnatural bloodstain like a path of blood. Haru, who finished everything just before his life ends, reached to his feelings of satisfaction, because he was able to save someone, someone he cherished. But in the end, later in the trial, the culprit confessed by their own will, however. We weren't able to know that it was Haruhiko who planned all this. All of this happened at dawn, and later in the morning, Turi and I broke into the arsenal and Haruhiko's body was found. In fact, in this case, the person who would be called the culprit was close to Haruhiko, and the culprit who just lost his life was the victim, himself, who actually finished this trick. But in the end, Haruhiko wanted to save the culprit, even at the cost of his life. The culprit of this incident, the identity of the killer, who Haruhiko cherished and wanted them to live so much, Loud noises. Satsuki or Nami, it was you. Oh, rough, dude. I don't want her to be dead. Now I have to go watch her get executed again. <laughs> Why is my life terrible? Perfect, indeed. Mata has a good reasoning, but maybe you have a talent for organizing cases too. I'm not happy at all. Satsuki Irinami. Satsuki-chan. Why is the mood so sad? I didn't go out to see you like this. Satsuki, you've always been like that. You're a strong girl. More, much stronger than me. Is that a compliment? <laughs> I don't know if it's strength or not, but even at times like this, it's my goal to be happy, even in the worst atmosphere. Well then, Maida's reasoning is over now. Shall we get to the voting time? Satsuki, can you really do that? Just die and not be scared? I don't want to die, of course I'm scared. But it's already gone water. What else can I do but accept it? At least it's not all of you will die because you can all live by sacrificing only one. I'm satisfied with that. Hey, Mr. 
it on me? Why do you keep trying to go ahead of the trial here? I'm the host. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. It seems like you guys reached a conclusion. And that's all. Now you guys put with the switch in front of your hands. So will be chosen as black and then will your answer be the correct one? Or answer or the wrong one? Oh, then what's it gonna be? Oh, this is so hard. Why do I have to do this again? I don't like seeing her die. I love her. Mm, the body died unanimously. The culprit of this case and the black end is... The identity of the black end who killed Kabashi Kakun is Miss Satsuki Aranami. You guys are right. Congratulations. Actually, what is with this case? A murder case that is not a murder. I knew it would be like this. I would have made the rules more thoroughly. Hi, uh, isn't it already too late? Hi, everyone. You guys are doing it badly. I, as the person in charge of this party, can't you please be a little brighter? There's no way I can be happy. Satsuki-chan is going to die now. Because it's painful. Satsuki worked so hard for us, throwing her own life. We couldn't do anything, even after reaching this point. You're wrong. It's not that you can't do anything. Satsuki? Yeah, okay, didn't I tell you before? Paul was not to be found, but to be created. You know I decided to save you all by sacrificing myself? Because that was my own way of creating hope. Well, what do you mean? If I survived by myself, it would have been meaningless to live in a world where there's no fun and no cabezing around. And more than anything, my power to defeat that guy is not enough. Huh? I'm smiling right now, but I'm even more than angry than... I'm more angry than anyone inside. I hate the mastermind, don't you guys? We're being treated like this because of that big dummy. If it wasn't for him, Kobashi Kawa wouldn't have died. Maki died, Higa died, Tomori died, Hatsuno died. Yamaguchi wouldn't have died, and Nori wouldn't have died, or U Uihara either. That's, we know that, even if we don't say it. If it wasn't for Manakuma's influence, we would have entered Hope's Peak safely, and have a pleasant school life. That's right! Although more than half of our friends have already died, I would defeat Monokuma no matter what happens. I would have punished it. I would have smash it. Hey, why are you saying all this stuff in front of someone else's face? So, I'll bet on my own hope on all of you. On us? I never wanted much. I'll be leaving this world soon. So, I just have one thing. No, wait. Please promise me two things. One! Be sure to survive. For a co-basing and me. Two. That Bonakuma guy. Please give it a good beating to the mastermind. Oh, paid revenge. Uh, Satsuki-chan. This is bad, really bad. You dare to take the students as you want in front of me. Then master the school. You'd insult me in my presence. And no, he... Anyways, Miss Iranami was chosen as the black end, so she's to be punished. In the end, you won't make fun of me anymore when I'm done with you. In that regard, I've prepared a very special punishment for the ultimate clown. So let's get for your crime. I'm gonna give you your best shot. I'm not afraid of anything like you. My friends will definitely kick your sorry butt. Wait, Satsuki, you don't need to be executed. I'd rather die. It's my fault, too. I'm a sinner, too. It was me who tried to commit a murder. I'm supposed to die. Monokuma, execute me. Satsuki's done nothing wrong. Now then, let's go! A very hard pounding punish! I can hold on a minute. Oh, God. Ugh, what? Jeez, you're tipsy. What to ruin my mood. Let me say to my friends a few last words. Teruya, then it's on Talia, no one is bad. Monokuma is the bad thing here. Everything is because of that thing. If Teruya keeps feeling guilty, then try harder to catch the mastermind. You don't need to be sorry at all, but if you die and make a tournament, then ask again. Well, Suki. 
And for you, Tyra. Tyra's strong. You have a very strong heart to overcome Ayumi's death. Please keep supporting everyone like you always do. Yeah, okay. Thank you, Satsuki-chan. Thank you. Next is Mekaru! It's the first time I've seen Mekaru act so surprised. I don't know what makes me so surprised about, but... As long as Kenjo is in that shape, everyone kind of needs a genius like Mekaru. I know this kind of is an unreasonable request, but... Please try to cooperate with everyone. And find the mastermind who brought this terrible misfortune on all of its victims. And Kurakawa. Stop! Shut up! Who said I was waiting for your long speech? Don't say anything disgusting with a small hope. Punishment time begins! Ah, uh, that's too much. When the villain is found out, you're supposed to wait for them. Let's go hard! What's your time? Your call, I didn't get to say anything to you guys, but I'll leave the rest to you guys. Oh, and one more thing I almost forgot. Come easy. I love you. Ugh. This is so rough. Let's go. She's in a barrel. You know, my question, what does this have to do with being a clown? Oh, she dies with a smile. It's like that that game. Uh, you ever play, like, I think it was like a pirate and he was like in the barrel and you had to like, you know, stick him in. I actually, I didn't own it. I never played it myself. I just knew people who had it like that. Bro. What does this have to do with being a clown? I don't understand. I don't enjoy seeing her die. Trying to play a hopeless game. Adios, funny red nosed lady. Sasuke chan? No. Damn it. Damn it. What do you think, Sad Right? Desperate, isn't it? What a lame hope. You guys won't be able to do a thing before you all punish me. No, it isn't. What was that, Mina? Who says I'm desperate? I'm not like that at all, right? Not Mina can? Of course, I'm really sad that Satsuki died, but we fully inherited Satsuki's will. We won't stop any- You won't stop us anymore. After I came to Host Peak Academy, I'm more full of fighting spirit than ever. Monokuma. You solely took your medicine. There's nothing scary about Bernie Raw's spirit. Alone, though? He's not alone. Megui. From this moment on, I will retract my previous solo actions. I'll cooperate. To put Monokuma into the trash. Oh my god, Makari Chan, what kind of change is this? Don't be mistaken. I'm not trying to play friends here. I know I'm a debt. Because of that, I have to pay it off. Why is Ms. Makari suddenly doing this again? Ms. Makari just needs to sit to do as well as before. Poking around and having fun. Why should you care about Ms. Iridami? Shut the hell up! Iwanami Satsuki is a human being that deserves respect. I've seen this for the first time ever since I was born into this world. To be able to give up one's life so purely for others, that is what I would call true hope. It was a life that God tried to save anyways. I'm fed up with murder games that are not fun. Murder games that are getting boring. Doesn't that seem like the perfect time to beat you down? Monokuma? No, rather. The mastermind controlling you from the shadows. Huh? No matter what you try, you can't do anything. It's already beyond your own grasp. No. It was you who kept us in the ballroom. We made up our minds. Right before they died. 
you will run out of ideas. You already know a lot more about you than you can imagine. Now, it is you who's cornered. Well, I don't know, but everyone is working hard, so, so I will too. I'll do my share for Haruhiko seek. Me too. We will definitely get you, Wanakuma. I'll avenge my friends who have died so far. Well, what's with these guys? Rather than despair, they're burning with fight alone. You guys are bluffing. You can't do a thing anyways. You will find out soon that you are only left with despair. And so the fourth class trial ended. We lost two of our friends, Haruhiko and Satsuki, who couldn't be exchanged for anything. The will that the two gave us was definitely engraved in our very souls. We're not afraid. A step by step from now on will be the big leap towards true hope. Kinjo! Kinjo! Can you hear me? Answer me if you're awake! Immediately after leaving the courtroom, Mekaru, who finally offered to cooperate with us, disappeared before we could call her. Everyone except for Mekaru went to check on Kinjo's condition. However, Kinjo was silent. We had no choice but to go back to each of our rooms with a little cluttered feeling. Bro, oh, what is with that eyeball? Do you see that above the camera? That's so creepy. I, ooh. I swear to God that was not there before. I don't like that. Ugh, what? Who is it? Is it morning? I know who it is. It's not even 7 a.m.? Hey, come out already, Marta! What? Wait a minute! Why did you take so long to answer? Was it because you had to feed information to the mastermind? Makaru? What? That's a moody expression you've got. No, it was just that you coming to my room? I wonder if the sky is going to divide in two now. It can't be helped. As I mentioned yesterday, I decided to cooperate with you in order to defeat the mastermind. I know that, but why did you suddenly change your mind? I told you I'm going to follow Iranami's idea. Hatane was a great person, but Iranami is more than that, just because she's a human who can. As if, my brother. Don't make me say useless things. You're always d drowned in every story, aren't you? Sorry. Also, now you're calling me by my name? So, are you dissatisfied? Do you want to be called incompetent for the rest of your life? Uh, no, no, of course not. It's better to be called by my own name. It was a bit embarrassing to be nicknamed incompetent, though it was accurate. I haven't admitted it yet. I don't want to be friends, but I want to have the least courtesy as long as I've decided to cooperate. Mekra tends to be weird like this. Usually she looks down on us and ignores us, but she doesn't do it recklessly. She admits something that can be admitted whenever necessary. Stop talking about nonsense. Come to my room right now. What? Mekaru's room? What are we doing today? Suddenly asking for that. I don't care if you've got feelings for me, so shut up and follow me. Ugh, I'm getting tired already. Oh, Ray chan did you bring my kun Tyra? Oturi and Kurokawa, too. Hey, don't do that shit show. How many times must I repeat that you're not my friends? I like that she's got a little teddy bear in her room. She's got a soft side. Everyone, what happened? It looks like Mekuri came out of her room at dawn and caught us one by one. Teria, those goggles. This one? It was Haru. It was left in the dressing room. I brought it. This is an atonement for myself, and also my own commitment to continue Haru's will. We need to move forward. That's right. The others, Kobashi Kawakun and Satsuki-chan, we should never forget. The will of our friends have died so far, but we can't just be sad anymore. Now it's time for us to fight back. Bit by bit. Very little, but something is starting to change and starts to move. Our hope is to not find it, but to create it. Only these words struck in my mind. So, why did you call us? This is an operational meeting. As long as I've decided to cooperate, everyone here will beat up Monokuma together and we shall escape. Right, Chan? Being an ally makes you feel so reliable now. Everyone here. Wait, then what do we do about Kinjo? 
<sighs> Why don't I look at the guy? He's a statue. He doesn't respond to anything, and I don't even know if he'll ever wake up. But if he wakes up, I'm not certain if he'll ever recover. So I'm guessing I can't hang out with him next chapter. Oh boy, Teruya, it's your time to shine, honey. You're the only one left. Uh, Akane, technically. Bro, am I gonna have to hang out with Akane? I'm gonna cry. We'll back send out Teruya before we even touch Akane. <laughs> I might be so stubborn. I, no, I mean, I should do her, honestly. If It's better than doing nothing, but I don't want to. Ugh. Then, of course, if you have him, you should be comfortable, but throw away your lingering regrets. We have no choice but to strike out, because I felt the fighting spirit from you. I choose to cooperate. Mekaru, stay in the way from us till now. Have you found out something? A lot of pile of things. Those of you who have not found anything are more curious. First off, wait a minute. There are going to be surveillance cameras here too. Are you okay with it? Are you an idiot? Of course I know. That's why I called you into my own room. My room is the only one that can jam surveillance cameras. To put it bluntly, it's instant jamming. Uh, instant jamming? Uh, oh, Tariqun, do you know what she's saying? Uh, not at all. <sighs> In short, my room is safe. The words here will not be leaked to the mastermind and our appearance is not visible. Really? Amazing. How did you do it? Power room, I'll do visual room. I know assembled some useful parts from the warehouse. That's how I made it. It's only temporary measure, so even if it's not perfect, it'll be safe. Makaru, you didn't just spend time alone. Of course not. You better thank me for inviting you. So, the first goal is to find out the identity of the mastermind. Of course, that is the most important thing, but before that, let's look at the preconditions. Preconditions? Why did we get involved in this division? I mean, that's the biggest mystery. Why did Hubs Peak Academy become this way? Why doesn't anyone come to save us? But that's the first thing we said with the others, right? At that time, we there were both Kenjo and Mekuru, but no conclusion was made. No, unlike then, there's one fact I do know. At first I thought it was a hypothesis, but because it was nonsense, but I was convinced after yesterday. Mekuru, you don't mean... Yes. It's a fact. A considerable amount of time has already passed since we entered this school. And the truth is, we don't remember it. M mikaka John. Also, I knew you'd react when he talked about this Mikaka Kurakawa. What? What's this all of a sudden? I'm obviously deeply grateful to Satsuki, and thanks to her, I was able to cooperate in order to punish the mastermind. But before that, there's a traitor we must catch. Mikaka Kurakawa, you know something. Honestly, I'm dubious about your true nature. Tell me everything you know. If you can't, then I'll consider you on the mastermind side. Uh, no way, as this trail. This is nonsense, right? Ugh. No. Trust me, I... If you're innocent, tell me the facts that you know. You do know that there's not only one or two suspicious actions you've done so far, right? Why did you shut your mouth? Are there any circumstances that you can't tell us? Me Mekaru, don't think too much. Kurokawa has to calm down before... Hello everyone, it's Morris of Amos. This is Wake Up Time. Let's have a lively one today too. A uh, morning announcement? It's already 7 a.m. Uh, that's not the problem right now. Oh, right, I almost forgot. I don't know if everyone had a good night, but I want everyone to please go to the gym. I have some great news to inform you. See you soon. Boo. What? I'll leave this story for later, but just so you know, I won't move on this time. Mikake Kurokawa. What? Well, what's the great news? It's only been a day since the trial was over, and suddenly... We'll just have to go. We have no choice. Mekuru and Kurokawa. 
The air that seemed to flow smoothly got tense in an instant. In this tense mood, Monokuma shows up to add even more anxiety. We all go to the gym, as Monokuma said, without concealing that unpleasant treat. Unpleasantness. There was a reality waiting for us that we could not imagine. Uh, there's the eyeball again. I don't like that. The first thing we knew as soon as we entered the gym was Kinder didn't come. If Monokuma didn't say anything, it only means he still fainted. But that fact is so casually forgotten because a more shocking scene unfolded in the gym. Huh? Ooh, who? A guy? He looks like a rapper. Like, what? Is, he, he looks like he belongs in, like, Hypnosis Mike. That's what his outfit makes me think of. I, I'm not even into Hypnosis Mike. I only know it from, like, other people. But this is what they look like to me. <laughs> guys. Guys. Oh, my God. It's it's finally time. The 16th student, Makuro Ikasaba, is here. I've made so many jokes about that. Um... I can't believe we actually have a 16th student. Remember, I was here in the last trial I did yesterday, but I'm sorry for calling again. So suddenly, but no matter what, there are things I had to tell you. That's a little bit early, but I'll announce the motive. A surprise motive event introducing the transfer student. Yeah, the 16th student, Makuro Ikasaba. This time I transferred to Hope's Peak Academy, the ultimate inventor, Yamato Kizaragi kun. Please greet him with an applause. He's kind of cute. I wonder what voice I should give him. Kisaragi. Nonsense. Yamatoni. <gasps> Ooh, she knows him. Is that like her brother? Isn't that what like Ni means? Like Ni Chan, <laughs> or is that Oni Chan? I don't know. I thought I thought Ni was like sibling. I'm not. My Japanese is questionable. And by questionable, I mean non-existent. I don't know Japanese. Everything I know is like anime, which means I know nothing. A suspicious figure who suddenly appeared as the transfer student. With his appearance, the situation began to unfold like a roller coaster. Boy, what roller coasters are you riding? <laughs> oh, we did it! Chapter four end. I did it twice. That was terrible. That was so long. Oh my god. <laughs> And now here he is. He he looks like he's related to Sarugi, kind of. All right, so um, that does conclude chapter four. We're gonna be starting chapter five next time, which is pretty exciting. We're getting down to the nitty gritty, really getting into the end of it. I'm curious, like, how many survivors we're gonna get? You know, like, and what what is the deal with this new character? I really do need to think about voices for him. I have a couple ideas. I have other voices up my sleeve, you know. But if you like, you know, you have any ideas or like hints to his personality, you could tell me. That would be good because otherwise I'm just gonna give him something like super random. <laughs> uh, I have ideas though. But yeah, that, that's gonna do it. Um, I'm so sad you guys couldn't see that original recording because I was very, very emotional over Satsuki's death. And I'm sure a lot of people who have been like just watching this have been waiting for me to react to Satsuki dying just because I talk about how much I love her every episode. Um, so yeah, worst possible one to have to re-record because that meant I had to re-watch my favorite character die. Thanks, technology. Um, but yeah, that's, that's gonna do it. Um, Luckily, because I've seen it before, I was, like, prepared, so I wasn't nearly as sad. I did get misty-eyed, though. I did get misty-eyed. Um, I'm really worried now because I literally like everyone that's alive except for Akane, and I don't think they're killing her off, so I don't know. I don't know who's going next. It better not be. Um, oh my god, there's literally no one I'm okay with except for Akane. This sucks. This sucks. <laughs> ah, I'm too attached to this cast, man. All right, so, okay. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and leave a like and a comment. I do read every comment. Um, I, I, love, I love comments. 
please leave a comment and subscribe if you haven't. It helps my channel out immensely. And um, I hope you're having a wonderful day or night or whatever time of day it is where you are. I do hope it's fantastic. And with that, I will see you when we start off chapter five. Later.